Hello viewers, thanks for watching our videos. If you not yet subscribed, please subscribe and click the bell icon. So in this module, we are going to discuss cut the bold type English alphabets capital and paste it into your notebook. Draw possible number of lines of symmetry for each of the letter. Then they are given some questions. We have to answer that questions. So first I given all the letters that is A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, all letters, 26 letters we took. So for that we need to draw line of symmetry. For A, line of symmetry will come like this. So A will be like this we will get one line of symmetry we will get for A. For B also we cannot get vertical line of symmetry only we will get horizontal line of symmetry. For C also we will not get only horizontal line of symmetry we will get. Then D we will not get vertical we will get horizontal line of symmetry. For E also we will not get vertical we will get only horizontal line of symmetry. So for E also middle so for F there is no line of symmetry for F. Next one <coughs> draw G how many lines of symmetry for this also no line of symmetry there is no horizontal there is no vertical. For H, you can divide line vertical, then we can divide horizontal also. Then I also we can get vertical, then horizontal. J, you can ought, there is no line of symmetry for J. For K, yes, one line of symmetry. For L, there is no line of symmetry. For M, one line of symmetry, that is vertical. For N, there is no line of symmetry. For O, how many lines of symmetry? So many lines of symmetries. It will have more than two. It will have more number that is infinite number of lines of symmetry that is more than two. You cannot take like this. You cannot take like this. Then for P also no line of symmetry. For Q also no line of symmetry. For R there is no line of symmetry. For S no line of symmetry. Then T, yes, you can take one line of symmetry vertically. Then U also one line of symmetry. For V also one line of symmetry. For W also one line of symmetry. For X two lines of symmetry so we will get for phi only one line of symmetry that is vertical for z there is no line of symmetry for x we can draw more than two lines of symmetry how it is is so you can take like this also off of to that then like this also you can take so for x it will be more more lines of symmetries. So after writing all the symmetrical lines for the different shapes, we have to answer the following questions. How many letters have no linear symmetry? That is, F don't have, that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. So, how many letters? 10 don't have. Next one. How many letters have one line of symmetry? That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 
five, six, seven, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So how many? Twelve are there. Next one. How many letters have two lines of symmetry? How many letters? That is one, two, three, then four. Actually, X and so four letters have two lines of symmetry. Next one. How many letters have more than two lines of symmetry? So here one, then two x, x and o that is only two. So our next question is what is that? Which of them have rotational symmetry? That means if you rotate any one shape, let's take C we are going to rotate or B we are going to rotate. So if you rotate this B completely 360 degree, then you will get the same shape. So if you get the same shape while rotating 360 degrees, then we can say that letter will have rotational symmetry. So B don't have rotational symmetry. So like that, if you take all the letters, so here, so A is there. Just I am going to rotate this one slowly. Just check. Or rotate like this. So no letter will get in here rotational symmetry. So like this we can rotate or you can rotate like this also. So anywhere we are getting any shape. No. Here also not getting. Then. So we cannot see the same letter as. So A, B, C don't have rotational symmetry. So here no rotational symmetry for this letters. Rotational symmetry for these letters. Next one. F and G H like that. So if you rotate continuously F G H observe H see H I we are getting the same letters if you rotate also. So if you see here this H and I getting the same after rotating also. So here H and I have rotational symmetry. Rotational symmetry. Other than remaining letters. So H and I. The two will have rotational symmetry. Then we need to check M and See, here you can check O and N are the same. It's showing that same after rotating also. So here which letters will have means N and O. That is N and O will have rotational symmetry. N and O have rotational symmetry. Like that here, H and I. Next one, Q or S T U V. So we are going to rotate. So here, S only getting that rotational symmetry. S only here. Then rotate completely. So no letter getting rotational symmetry with same so here only s is getting rotational symmetry s have 
rotational symmetry so once again you can check anywhere we are getting rotational symmetry or not completely we are rotating but we are not getting anywhere rotational symmetry other than s next one so w x y z is rotating so here what letters we are getting here so x and z two will have rotational symmetry have rotational symmetry why because after rotating this we are getting the same letters once again rotate so if you rotate like that then here x and z will have rotational symmetry so which which letter will have rotational symmetries how many letters that is 1 2 h i then 2 3 then 4 5 6 so which letter will have rotational symmetries that is which of them have rotational symmetry that is h i so h i h i next and n o n o n o after that yes s and z x that are the will have rotational symmetries so our next one is which of them have point symmetry so point symmetry is nothing but after rotating so point symmetry is nothing but after rotating or if you see this picture up and down it will come it as same means then it will have point symmetry so i am rotated this one with 180 degrees so here no letter is coming as same as previous next one if you rotate like this yes we are getting h and i h and i as point symmetry so what you can write h and i have point symmetry that is up and down we can see the same next one rotate this one so point symmetry n and o n and o well c as same as previous one have point symmetry then q r s t u v so rotate it like this only s you can see yes you can see as up and down have point symmetry then so this one already it's rotated so actually it should be like this then it need to rotate like this then z and x z and x have point symmetry so what letters will have point symmetry is so which letters will have point symmetry that is h and i h i then o n o n and yes z w yes x z thanks for watching please subscribe